beautiful Gail is here with Tony Satries, and of course she has been cooking up a storm. You've been up here for about an hour or so already. I have. So let's talk about some of the things we're going to be cooking today. Okay, well we are doing, we're, we're talking about parties, we're having our Christmas parties, we're having lots of friends over. So I slow smoked a uh, pork butt, mm -hmm. and so we have pulled pork sliders up here. That's what we're doing today. Absolutely. So I'll show you how to do that with okay. our Tony Sachery's um, marinades. We're using the injectable butter flavor marinade. Okay. We also have roasted garlic or butter and jalapeno. You can get all these at your store. Mm -hmm. um, and, and just to show you, we have some new products out. Before I do this, we have a Bloody Mary mix. Really? Okay, I haven't seen that one. Some sandwich sauces. Oh yeah, no, those are some of the favorites. And then some new bold seasonings. So um, I just wanted to tell you a little bit about that. So we're going to pour this marinade into a different container to okay. avoid contamination. Okay. And um, you can move your little okay. sample over to the side. <laughs> so when you inject, you do about one and a half uh, ounces per pound of meat. Mm -hmm. So we're going to inject this roast wow. in several places. About an inch apart. Yeah. Now, you know, fam uh, Tony Satchery's is a family-owned business, in mm -hmm. and they're from South uh, Louisiana. Mm -hmm. But the, the family still runs the business, and really nice people. Oh, I'm sure, yes. They treat you like family, and their whole line is just delicious, you know, all their products. So we, we've injected this, and I'm not going to finish it just because of the time of TV, but we're going to put us some bold uh, more spice seasoning on today, mm -hmm. and we have the bowl as well. Whatever, whatever is your taste, but you can get all these products at your local grocery store. And kind of talk to me. Do you guys spend a lot of time coming up with new ideas? Because it always seems like you have something I awesome know, and huh? amazing coming out. Well, these um, these just came out this year. We have three flavors: oh, zesty, yeah. spicy, and sweet, and the Creole. These are delicious. Oh yes, they are. I've you can mix them into salads, pasta salads, or you can just use them on sandwiches. Um, the bold is a new flavor as well. It's got a little extra kick to it. Mm -hmm. So um, if you want a little extra kick to your food, we, we have the bold out. And then all your jambalaya mixes and fish fries, you know, they just have so many products out there. Oh, they sure do. My husband likes the red they, beans and rice. Oh, so yeah. I yeah. love those red beans and rice. So anytime you use Tony Stafford's, it's a good, 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 good thing. Absolutely. Now, the injectable that we put in there, you said it was the Creole style I use butter. A, yeah, I use the Creole style butter. Um, sometimes I use the roasted garlic on the pork loins. Uh, this is the butter and jalapeno. They're all very good. Can uh, I talk about what the what kind of flavor that gives it, you know, especially well, cooking from the inside out. It is a buttery flavor, mm -hmm. um, but then they have their spices uh, included in the seasoning. Oh, okay. So you're injecting the flavor inside of the meat. And, and then, the seasonings as well. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's and great. you know, you can fry turkeys, you can inject and bake uh, chickens with this, mm -hmm. roast. You could put this in the oven for uh, a considerable length of time, two hours or so, and cook it just as well. Yeah. And then you'll come out with your pulled pork like this, like so we show you here. How long do you recommend cooking? Um, I put this on um, indirect heat on the grill for two hours, and I keep the heat about 350 degrees. Mm -hmm. When the roast is, you know, just falling apart, mm -hmm. you just take it off and dig in. All right. Now, is that um, kind of make the the meat really, really tender? Oh yes. As you can see here, mm -hmm. I, I don't, I don't know if you'll take a bite or not. Will you? <laughs> you need your fingers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Isn't it's that delicious? Mm -hmm. And it's got the smoke flavor. I use mm -hmm. the smoke chips on the side, so. Uh, and there's a little sauce on there too. Which sauce do we use? We used um, the Creole. Um, let's see which one is it. This one. Mm -hmm. I used the uh, Zesty, and so it's a, got a little kick to it to, if you can taste it. And it's also Absolutely. made out of uh, low-fat mayonnaise. All right. Well, so, thank you so much as always, Gail. And thank of course, you. You know these are, uh, you know, things that you can make for any kind of party that you're planning or coming up. Definitely, mm -hmm. and it feeds a crowd. Mm -hmm. I mean, for eleven dollars, you can feed twenty-five people, thirty wow. people. Wow. Um, so you can go to the website also and uh, request one of these little books. Uh, it's a cookbook. They'll send it to you free. It has 90 recipes, anything from roux all the way to desserts. All right. Well, sounds great. We'll be right back after the break. <laughs> 